Hi everybody! I'm gonna do a reaction to Wednesday, season one, episode number two. Wu is the loneliest number. So it is Wednesday. You know what that means? It's time to do a reaction to episode number two of Wednesday. The first episode was really, really good, and it ended in a cliffhanger with that wolf-looking thing attacking. The guy who was like a werewolf or something like that. That was so crazy. I don't know who the wolf is. I was thinking maybe a member of Wednesday, but you never know. But I'm so excited to do the reaction to episode number two. Let's do this and hope you enjoy my reaction. Yes, so excited for episode number two. The story is about to take a dark turn. Oh shit. <laughs> shit. Oh snap. How could you miss a dead body? Because it wasn't there. Oh shit. There's no blood, no sign of a struggle, nothing, nada. My search party looked all night. Well, your search party must have left their seeing eye dogs at home. Oh I shit. Maybe it was one of your classmates. Sure. Oh I shit. Question offensive. Well, I don't care because I got three other dead bodies in the morgue. I asked that those were bad attacks. You know, man, I disagree on that. So you oh. automatically assume that a Nevermore student is the murderer, even though there's no evidence that a crime was even committed. Oh shit. I'm sorry. I forgot. You want to teach the good outcasts here, right? Oh. What are you doing out the woods with them, Miss Adams? I heard a noise in the forest and I went to go investigate. The monster wasn't a bear or some other wild animal? I've hibernated with grizzlies. I know the difference. Oh. Thank you, Sheriff. I will call the man. Oh shit, who's the man? Someone is trying to cover up Rowan's murder. That's the only reason to scrub the crime scene. Is that your professional opinion as the daughter of a murderer? Oh My shit. Is twice the man you are. And the only thing he murders is the occasional opera in the shower. Woo! <laughs> it's been a long night and I'm tired of your games. I'm not playing games. Because you and I both know that there's a monster out there. Oh shit. And Rowan is his latest victim. Mm-hmm. Sheriff, what? You're gonna want to see this. Uh oh. What? Oh wait, what the fuck? Edgar Allan Poe said, "Believe nothing you hear." Oh, but wasn't he supposed to die in the first episode? Oh shit! Yes. Understand why you would claim you witnessed a murder? Was it to gain attention? Why should I bother telling? Don't try and learn me the one of your psychological traps. <laughs> Wait, look at the um shrinks her eyes. They kind of look like the wolf's eye, look like the blue. Yes, yeah, so you decided to stick around Jericho. But you see Dr. Kimbot too? For the record, I believe you. Aww. So cute. Ladies, come on. Let's work on those teeth. <laughs> If Bianca Barclay wins again this year, I will literally scratch my own eyes out. I'm oh shit. Hi, <laughs> so What's Rowan's story? Other than being a weird loner? No offense. <laughs> then take him. <laughs> Except for Thorpe's roommate? You know, if you had a cell phone, you could just text him and ask him. Oh shit. Yoko, come on, flare those whiskers. Just as long as you're lakeside cheering us to victory on race day. <laughs> She's so peppy. Maybe it's time to lean into it. What's that? Oh, part of the book, right? I need to speak with Rowan. I can't find him. It won't be possible, I'm afraid. He's been expelled. What? For what? You had a psychic vision, didn't you? Your mother started having visions around your age. Aww. May I go now? Not until you've picked your extracurricular activity. Oh, shit. I'll be keeping my eye on you. Always watching. Last person who took only lost a finger. Oh shit. Oh shit. We well, said you'd be stopping by. But yeah. messed up. Who did you tell? The sheriff? You think I trust normie cops? Oh shit. Anyway, let's get this audition over with. Uh, what are you? Alto, soprano, or just loco? <laughs> wow. Oh shit. Have you ever shot a bone arrow before? Oh man, live targets. <laughs> Rowan's always been a little off, but uh, the last couple weeks he's been more erratic. Tyler and his friends are a bunch of jerks. 
Oh shit. I can't stand the fact that this school is the only thing propping up their podunk talent. Says the boy whose life was served to him on a silver platter. Hey, you know, oh shit. Oh shit! Are you interested in the ancient art of beekeeping? The hive life isn't for everyone. <laughs> Most kids are afraid of venomous insects. It's also one of the few <laughs> in which females dominate. The queen bee. Oh. Roman, we need to talk. Wednesday. I'm not allowed to speak to anyone. You had a lot to say the other night when you tried to kill me. Oh shit. Tell me I was. Oh shit. They had lost him. Oh, wait, what? On earth? There's an open spot next to me. Oh shit. I doubt Wednesday is impressed by your tricks, Mr. Thorne. Who can tell us the name of this beauty? Dendro Phylax and Denii. Oh shit. Otherwise known as the Ghost Orchid. First discovered on the Isle of Wight in 1854. Oh. Very good, Wednesday. Looks like you may have competition for first chair, Bianca. Woo! Thank you, ladies, for those illuminating insights. Her eyes are very They're creepy, though. Plants aren't the only carnivores in class today. You still believe there's a creature up there, don't you? Mm-hmm. Right. We're talking about Mom. Oh, shit. Remember her? Damn. I, I was hoping we could fire up the grill and they catch the big game. Aww. Oh, these warm, fuzzy memories they're making, Dad. Aww. At beekeeping club this afternoon, we need you as decoy. Mm-hmm. What did you ask think? Oh, wait, you can't because he's mad at you. Why is he mad? He's the one who screwed up with Rowan. All I know is that we spent an hour giving each other manis, and he really opened up. <laughs> it feels like you don't respect him as a person. He's your family. Aww. He would do anything for you. Go apologize, and I'll reconsider helping you. Oh. <laughs> I snapped at you. I'll check mm -hmm. my tone in the future. I know I'm stubborn, single-minded, mm -hmm. and obsessive. But those are all traits of great writers. <laughs> when Rowan showed me this, it confirmed my greatest fear. That I'm going to be responsible for something terrible. Aww. Not good terrible like Ivan. Bad terrible. Aww. Read the word of this to anyone and I will end you. Oh shit. Besides, I should be thanking you. This is the most girls I've ever had in the shed. Remain calm. Peace detect fear. I have a very big smoker and I handle it like a pro. <laughs> Oh shit. You must think it's weird. I'm stalking him. No. Aww. I consistently stalk my parents. <laughs> oh. I thought Rowan was in danger. Turns out I was wrong. Then he proceeded to use his telekinesis to try and choke me to death. Shit. Have you seen this before? It's a watermark from a book I'm looking for. I think it's the symbol to an old student society. Um, I was told they disbanded years ago. Any idea why? Sorry. I've been here a year and a half, and I still feel like an outsider. Aww. Is that because you're the only normie on the staff? To tell you the truth, I've never really fit in anywhere. Aww. Never lose that Wednesday. The ability to not let others define you. Mm hmm So if you ever need anyone to talk to, the door to the conservatory is always open. Aww. Oh shit. Got to be around here somewhere. Start investigating. Oh. Aww. Oh shit. Oh man. What on earth? Oh shit. Oh. I'm sorry about Rowan. Now you guys used to be close. Since when did you give a damn about Rowan? Oh shit. And you were the one who was afraid he would do something to Wednesday. Isn't that why you've been following her around like an eager eyed puppy? Because she hasn't tried to manipulate me. Oh shit. I can't wait to crush Ophelia Hall tomorrow and watch her werewolf roommate. Oh, oh shit. I like to win. Is that so wrong? Yeah, and you wonder why I broke up with you. Oh shit. I used to love my killer instinct. 
Not anymore, bitch. We were good together, Xavier. <sighs> were we? Oh shit. Is that just how you wanted me to feel? Oh shit. It wasn't an accident, Bianca's behind it. How do you know? Doesn't matter. You and I are going to take her down tomorrow. Oh shit. Wait, you're joining the Black Cats? You're willing to do that? <laughs> For me? Aww. I want to humiliate Bianca so badly that the bitter taste of defeat burns in her throat. Oh shit. Yeah, but we'll see you're doing it because we're friends, right? Aww. Then we just need to beat her at her own game. Mm hmm. Your costume's in the tent. Oh Costum. shit. OMG. <laughs> Oh shit. Just that I'm better than you. Oh shit. To the Edgar Allan Poe Cup. Each team must row across to Raven Island, pull a flag from Crackstone's crypt, and hustle back without sinking or being sunk. Excuse us. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Thanks. Oh shit. <laughs> yes. Ha uh ha. -huh. Stay here and make sure Bianca can't sabotage her boat. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Who on earth? You were the key. Taking a cat nap? <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Yes! Sucker! <laughs> yes! Sucker! Oh shit! Vibe with like the portraits. Oh shit. Oh, that's where the book is. Yeah. But the minute I inch towards the truth. Oh shit. I'm not afraid of the dark. Wow, that was intense. That was so good. I love it. I love how once they join like the cat team and then they want to get the sirens. And this whole mystery surrounding like like the wolf and the, the spirits like Rowan, maybe there's like a cult? But then for some reason the shrink or the one kind of have like the blue eyes like the wolf, but also the one with the glasses also kind of has that features. I don't know, but that was so good. Such a great episode. I love it. I hope you enjoyed my reaction. Make sure you come back next Wednesday when I do reaction to episode number three. 
If you like watching reaction videos, make sure you subscribe. If you enjoy my reaction, make sure you give a thumbs up and a comment down below with the episode.